win for thousands of people across Tulsa County. Early voting continued today. And 2 News reporter Dan Perlman is live at the election board to tell us how things have gone so far. Dan? Yeah, yeah, Marlo. Well, you know, right now it's actually pretty quiet out here, but earlier today, the line to vote actually spread all the way down Denver. Now, this was the second day you could early vote, and election officials told me this was actually not the largest crowd they've ever seen. Take a look at the line. This is awesome that so many people have decided to come out and exercise their right. 2,356 voters long. It's a freedom we have. A mother. Because every vote counts. I truly believe that every vote counts. And her daughter. And it's just great to actually feel like you're important in this country. They are just a few of the more than 6,000 voters who have already cast their ballots in Tulsa County. So, about the crowd. The lines are not nearly as long as they were in 2008 when I also voted here at the county election board. And there are actually a couple of reasons for that. One, the election board does report that fewer people have showed up to early vote this go around. Also, the election board set up extra booths to handle the crowd. So 440 people voted every hour. As for the ones we spoke with, they hope you do too. It is important that you come down and you vote. You exercise your right. It's one of your God-given rights that we get here in America. As long as we've got it, use it. Yeah, and if you do still want to vote early, you can. The election board will be open on Monday from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m., so you can do that. Remember, though, this is the first presidential election where you need to bring your photo ID or your voter registration card in order to get a ballot. Live in North Tulsa, Dan Perlman, 2 News, works for you. Thank you, Dan, and 2 News is your source for election coverage, both nationally and locally. We have a team of reporters to cover all of the local races. Our expanded coverage will run all evening on Tuesday, starting at 6 p.m. on our digital channel, 2.2, and on KGRH.com.